Please, while they're getting themselves together, uh, like, turn your cell phones off and any other noisemakers. Thank you, John, for coming. Thank you. Hi, everybody. Thank you all very, very much. We are really, really honored to be a part of this wonderful festival. I know, I think we're the first barbershop quartet for sure that's ever been here. So we really thank David and Vic. Uh, that, that, that's a David too, but we, I really mean that David and that Vic uh, for, for letting us be a part of this wonderful event. We certainly have enjoyed it. And uh, we are Crossroads and we're very famous. Um, <laughs> Not so much for our singing, actually, but you've probably seen us in magazines or billboards. We're also known as the four stages of male pattern baldness. <laughs> that is just a good old joke. And so before we sing any more, I want to make a little special announcement, a special thank you. This guy that's standing to my left uh, is not the usual baritone of Crossroads. Brandon Guyton, who sings baritone with us normally, uh, not to bring things down too much, but right now he's in the hospital. <laughs> we don't know exactly what, here in New Orleans. I mean, he flew in here and he's been sort of dealing with 102 degree fever. And, uh, and so we, he went to the emergency room yesterday. They're still trying to figure out what's going on with him. And he's uh, spent the night there and that's where he is right now. So if you're a praying person, give Brandon your prayers, please. In the meantime, this wonderful young guy, Theo, who's an international championship lead singer, actually, we called him about 8.30 p.m. last night and said, Theo, what do you think about flying into to New Orleans <laughs> tomorrow morning? Never <laughs> He's never sung with us before. Uh, and uh, so Theo is reading some of our music, but I mean, let's give it up for Theo Hicks. Uh, so... We're really, really thankful to Theo, and he's just an amazing talent, amazing musician. Uh, so he flew, flew in from Indianapolis, actually, and he's flying back home today at four. So, so this is the way he's spending his Saturday. So thanks again, Theo, for everything. And, uh, and uh, don't screw up. Uh, okay, yeah. So, all right, I'm talking a little too much, but I do want to set this song up. Uh, if you are here for the lecture that uh, David and Vic gave so beautifully, uh, we did a song there called Sweet Adeline. We're going to sing Sweet Adeline again, but we're going to do a different version of Sweet Adeline. I don't know if there's anybody out there who is a fan of the Golden Gate Jubilee Quartet. Does anybody know who that is? Oh, good. There's a few of you. Well, they're worth looking up. They have so many wonderful recordings. 
And, uh, and they did a recording of Sweet Adeline, a great barbershop standard, but they did it in their own style. It's an African-American quartet uh, who actually formed as a barbershop quartet and became very, very popular in the 30s, 40s, 50s. They had great longevity. They were in the movie Stormy Weather with Lena Horne and Cab Calloway and a lot of other luminaries. If you, probably a lot of you have seen that movie. Anyway, they did a great recording that was sort of their own style of this great barbershop standard. They did it back in 1938. I played it for the guys and uh, we all thought that sounded so cool that we learned it by ear off the recording. So we're now going to try to emulate the 1938 recording of the Golden Gate Jubilee Quartet singing Sweet Adeline. Sweet Adeline. Sweet Adeline. My Adeline. My Adeline. Each night, dear heart. Each night, dear heart. For you. Fair face be your fair face be you're the flower of my heart sweet and sweet and light sweet Adeline, each night, dear heart, oh, 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 for you I pine. In all my dreams, dreams your fair face beams. You are the flower of my heart, sweet Adeline. You are the flower of my heart. Baritones have always been obnoxious. Sweet and Sweet and Thank you. Very much. <clears throat> All right. Uh, we're now going to feature our lead mic on a great song that I bet everybody in the room knows. Uh, it was a classic by Roy Orbison, and it was arranged for another quartet. We promptly stole it, uh, but it was arranged by <coughs> David Wright. Now, David is too humble to say this, but <laughs> David is the greatest barbershop arranger in the history of mankind. Yes. I only said that so I'd have enough time to drink a little water. <laughs> no, he truly is. So uh, this is an arrangement that David did, uh, honestly, for another quartet that didn't really sing it. So he gave it to us. Thanks, yeah. David. <laughs> do, 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 I was do, 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 do. smile for a while but when I saw you last night you held my hand so tight and you stopped to say hello Over you when you, you 
said so long, left me standing here alone, alone and crying. I am crying, you left me crying, crying. alone and crying, crying. It's hard to that I was over you, but it's true, but it's true, oh, so it's true, yes it's true, I love you even I love more, you more than even I more did than before, but darling, what can I do? Well, they say I've got to make the best of every day. So my life I simplify, and now I found my way. I don't believe in fretting and grieving. Why mess around with strife? I never was cut out to step and strut out. Give me the simple life. Some find it pleasant dining on pheasant. Those things roll off my knife. Just serve me tomatoes and mashed potatoes. Give me the simple love. I know a cottage small is all I'm after. Not one that's spacious and wide. A home that's full of joy and laughter with the ones you love inside. Some like the high road, I like the low road, free from the grief and strife. Oh, it all sounds corny and seedy, but yes, indeedy, give me the simple life. Give me, give me, please, oh, give me, oh, give me that simple life. I can't eat small as all I'm after, not one big and wide. I need some joy and laughter, and the ones I love inside. Now, some like the high road, I like the low road, free from the grief and strife. No strides, corny and seedy, sinking here in it, but is a deedy. So come on and give me, give me the simple life. Now I know how to make the best of every day for all my life. Now for all my life.
<laughs> cool. Now, I just want you, let's just take a minute here. Theo learned this song be between 8.30 and now. <laughs> That's incredible. This guy's awesome. Thanks again, Theo. No, let's, not, let's, stop, let's stop applauding for him. We'll, just, we'll praise him, but let's, that's, that's it. Let's not get big headed. But anyway, uh, that's a great song that was not arranged by David Wright. Uh, but many were. Uh, this is another one that was also not arranged by David Wright, but this is a great song that we, uh, we became, we've recently become really good friends with another great African-American quartet that I'll bet a lot of you have heard of. They've been around for uh, literally next year, it'll be their 100th year anniversary. Same four guys. <laughs> no, okay, mean. it's not the same four guys, no, but, uh, but they did form 100 years ago called the Fairfield Four. Any Fairfield Four fans out there? Good. Okay, you guys got to listen to a few singers now and then, okay? Uh, the Fairfield Four, they're just great and fantastic guys. Sort of a just old Southern Gospel Jubilee kind of quartet. And uh, we've had a chance to do several shows and things with them and just have gotten to know and love them. And uh, this is a song that we sang, we learned so that we could sing this together with them on a show. It's just a great Fairfield Four song. It's like stepping back in history. And uh, we just love singing it. It's called There Must Be a City. Well, there must be a city. Hey, hey, there must be a place. There must be somewhere I can see him face to face. Well, there must be a mansion high up in the sky. Do, 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 do. There must be a city somewhere. Oh, yeah. City. Hey, hey, there must be a place, there must be somewhere where I could see him face to face. Well, now there must be a mansion that it's high up in the sky. Do, 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 do. Oh, there must be a city somewhere. Oh, yeah. One of these mornings, it won't be long, you're gonna look for me, and I'll be gone, I'm going up to heaven to sing and shout, there'll be nobody there to turn me out. I'm gonna look up David in the heat of the day, tune up my harp and begin to play, do 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 oh, there must well be a city somewhere, oh yeah. City. Hey, hey, there must be a place, there must be somewhere where I can see him face to face. Well, there must be a mansion that it's high up in the sky. Do, 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 do. Oh, there must be a city somewhere, oh yeah. Heaven, I sing and shout. There'll be nobody there to turn me out. I'm gonna look up David in the heat of the day. Tune up my harp and begin to play. I'm gonna look up David in the heat of the day. Tune up my harp and begin to play. Do 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 do. Oh, there must be a city somewhere. Oh yeah, there must. Well, there must well there be a place. Well, there must well be somewhere where I could see him face to face. Well, now there must well be a mansion that it's high up in the sky. Tra la 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 la. Tra la 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 la. Oh, there must well be a city somewhere. Oh yeah. All right, let's go into this next one. <coughs> what he also uh, failed to mention, actually, uh, about Brandon is that 
he, he's the one that blows all of our pitches. Right. And so, so now uh, Mike's trying to learn. So now I had to learn what all the songs, the keys, the songs are in. So we're not we're not very happy with Brandon this week. I think that's hard. Try learn the whole show. Why aren't you blowing the pitch pipe? Yeah. <laughs> Okay. Well, you rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. Oh Lord, you rock my soul. Why don't you rock my soul? Oh, you rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. Oh Lord, you rock my soul. Why don't you rock my soul? Oh, the rich men live. live. Why don't you praise King Children Jesus? He lives so well. Why don't you praise the Lord? But when he died, Why don't you praise King Jesus? He got a hole in hell. Why don't you praise the Lord? He said, see ya, the sun, see ya. Watch the she run, don't you never let her catch a window. Yo, one gun down now. The rich man lay down. He lived so well. And when he died, got him a home in hell. I said, Lord, you rock my soul. Why don't you rock my soul? Oh, you rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. You rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. Oh, Lord, you rock my Soul. Why don't you rock my soul? Lord, oh, how you rockin' my soul and tell my sins goodbye. Say and rockin' my soul up to that land on high. Send peace to my heart and make my life whole. And now I know how you rock my soul. Let's we sleep. The poor man lived such a humble life. He gave praise to the Lord. That's so why that when he died, he went to a home on my children. Why don't you praise the Lord? He said, when he died, got him a home on I said, Lord, you rock my soul. Why don't you rock my soul? So rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham. My soul, my soul in the bosom of Abraham. rock my Abraham, rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham, rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham, Lord, rock my soul, Lord, rock my soul in the sky, in the sky, make my home up on high, up above the Lord, rock my soul till the day that I die, for all my life, for all my life, for all my life, for Lord, rock my soul now, rock my soul in the bosom of Abraham, you rock my soul, come on and rock. Asking no, if David, that one, that he didn't one. do that the one. The next one. The next one David arranged. David didn't arrange that one either. I guess you don't really do much for many arrangements at all, do you? <laughs> <laughs> well, this next one we're going to do was a David Wright arrangement. We just love this arrangement. It's from an old hymn, and we asked David. There's a lot of great choral arrangements of this, a lot of versions of this that you can find. And uh, we really just, uh, I was thinking about this song one day and just the message of it and really just sort of a message that we all need these days, as I'm sure uh, you all will agree as soon as you hear it. And uh, there's a lot of things, if you turn on the news, it's pretty dire. And there's a lot of just angst and turmoil and a anger. And, and uh, this song is just takes everything away, <laughs> brings us back to just this great hymn, just this great feeling. There's also a lot of beauty in the world. There's a lot of good in the world and a lot of things that are worth fighting for. And uh, so I asked, we asked David if he'd arrange this song for us because it's a song that basically says, when I really look out at 
everything that's in the world, how can I keep from singing? Here's another great Fairfield Four song. Uh, we learned this before we met him. We loved this song. It's one of the very first songs we learned as a quartet when Theo was still in diapers. You might still be in diapers. Are you still in diapers? <laughs> so uh, <laughs> we've been singing together for how long is it now? 12 years. 12 years. Uh, so and how old were you 12 years ago, Theo? Uh, I don't know. Uh, 18. <coughs> wow. Sorry, 19. Oh, really? Oh, so you're an old guy already. So, Anyway, this is a really, really great song. Features the bass. I mean, 
what could be better than that? <laughs> and, uh, and it's a great song that uh, they used to sing. It's called Roll, Jordan, Roll. Or as the Fairfield Four used to do it, Roll, Jordan, Roll, Roll, Jordan, Roll. I want to go. say is that he thinks every song features the bass. So. And doesn't it? <laughs> no. <laughs> I just want to say a special th a shout out and thank you to Lynn Abbott who's sitting out there. He was mentioned in the last lecture but my dissertation, a lot of you may not know that I have a PhD in music. Oh God. <laughs> All right. And, uh, and uh, my dissertation actually was on the African American origins of barbershop music uh, using sort of sound clips and listening to old recordings and all of that, but I was inspired to do my dissertation and therefore the course of my life was completely changed by Lynn Abbott, whose seminal work I read and got so excited about, as did Vic and David did too, and, and uh, so that's just been so meaningful, uh, Lynn, so thank you so much for the work that you've done on that. So if you wouldn't mind, Lynn, would you just like stand up and take a bow, is he here? Is Lynn? Yeah, there he is. Thank you, Lynn. 
so uh, also, you, it was announced that we do have CDs for sale. So if, if you'd like to uh, purchase a thousand of those, we would be grateful. <laughs> We got to get Theo a plane ticket back to Indiana. <laughs> <laughs> so please feel free to do that. We've got uh, four recordings out now. Uh, it's one for fifteen dollars. Oh, ten bucks. Ten bucks. Yeah, it's ten for the well, you guys better get them now. I'm telling you, ten dollars. Okay, cool. So uh, festival price. Uh, we're gonna do one more song for you, and we just have been so thrilled to be here, and we thank you very, very much to all the organizers, and especially to David and Vic, who really are, are responsible for getting us here. And I hope they've enjoyed this music, and, and we're really, really proud to be the, the first barbershop quartet, hopefully maybe not the last, uh, that, that's, that's a part of this wonderful festival. And uh, this song that we're about to do is a song that we have closed our show with for several years now, probably 10 years. Uh, when we were competing at the international contest, you're trying to find, you get, if you're lucky, you get to sing six songs, you want to find songs that really, you know, feel like you can pour your heart into and, and uh, that really will show you off and also that you can just feel like, you know, this is putting myself on stage. And, and uh, it's very difficult to find that kind of music. But we heard a recording from the great Buffalo Bills Quartet. Now, I don't know if any of you guys know who the Buffalo Bills are, but if you've seen the movie The Music Man, the school board quartet is the Buffalo Bills, okay? And uh, they sang a beautiful ballad in that show called Light a Rose. And uh, we don't know that song, no. uh, but it's, one, it is a beautiful yeah, song. A nice song. We should really learn that song. That would be wonderful for us to learn that. But there's another recording. <laughs> there's another recording that they made. It sort of featured a tenor solo, but we just love the song, and it's a song that many of you probably know. Uh, and uh, we just thought this is the one we want to sing. And we asked our dear friend and mentor. David Wright, if he would arrange this song for us, which he did. And uh, we credit this song and David's, arrange David's arrangement of this song with us being blessed to, to win the year, that year in 2009, 2009. And so ever since then, literally, we've, we've pretty much always closed our shows with this. So we're gonna close this one with this song as well with our thanks to you again. We've really enjoyed seeing it for you. And if you don't mind, would you please help us give another big thanks to Theo Hicks. <laughs> Hope to see you all again soon. Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. I'm tired and weary of pain. So devil for my pay, but that lucky old son has nothing to do but roll around heaven all day, fuss with my woman, toil for my key. Sweat till I'm wrinkled and gray. While that lucky old son has nothing to do but roll around heaven all day. My soul is tired and my sad heart's aching, but joy, joy and hope all gone. There's no relief for a back that's breaking. Can't go on living this 
Bravo. 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 Man. Man, you know, somewhere Johnny Hartman and Billy Eckstein are going, uh oh, who's that? Nice work, Johnny. Nice work. The Crosswords Quartet. Wonderful work. Wonderful work. Uh, they have some uh, CDs for sale uh, out in the lobby for the festival price of 10 bucks. 10 bucks. Anyway, <laughs> the Crossroads Quartet. Well, a uh, brief announcement. Um, I'm Don Lewis, and uh, once again, a hearty welcome to the annual Satchville Summerfest, presented by Chevron. And this is, of course, the Hilton Satchville Legacy Stage. And this event is produced by the French Quarter Festivals, Inc. They do a lot of wonderful festivals around this city. It, minimal cost. It's just lovely. They showcase New Orleans culture and heritage since 1984. This event is made possible through the sponsorship of community-minded organizations and the sale of a beat of beer. So, you know, you can go ahead and take a few for the team, and we'll be thankful for it. Jack Daniels, Sonoma Couture, Corbell, Tequila, yes, yes, yes. Tequila Heredera, Finlandia, Pepsi, Aquafina, Bubbly, Bayou Rum, the French Market Cold Brew, Louisiana Iced Tea, and Festival Merchandise, which helps pay for great entertainment like this, the security, sanitation, and recycling here at the festival, and production costs. Please support your festival by purchasing from our beverage and merchandise booths. Do your part to keep the festival clean by using recycling and trash containers on site, and support our recycling efforts by purchasing a reusable souvenir cup at beer and cocktail booths. And please enjoy responsibly. Special thanks to the Satchmo Legacy stage contributors like Hilton, Harris New Orleans, Joseph K. and Inez Eichenbaum Foundation, Ella Fitzgerald Charitable Foundation, Barbershop Harmony Society, the Fertile Foundation, Ricky and Vicky Nurigan, and Andrea Duplessis. And thank you to all our sponsors, including Chevron, Brown Foreman, Abita Brewing Company, GE, Fidelity Bank, WWL TV, Offbeat Magazine, and so many, many, many more. Pick up a schedule for all of our festival offerings, events, and the culinary lineup. Go grab a bite before the next act begins and stop by the merchandise tent to purchase the official Satchmo Summerfest poster, t-shirts, and souvenirs. 
please enjoy this 19th annual Satchmo Summerfest presented by Chevron and Finch Market Festivals, Inc. And happy birthday to the one and only Louis Armstrong. Thank you. <laughs>